Today we are going to make this right here called pot de cream. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is really. I guess we're just it sounds cool. It sounds good though, so we're gonna make it. And uh so yeah. How do you make it, Riley? So first you need eight ounces of uh, uh chocolate chips, semi sweet. Then you need two tablespoons of sea salt, uh sugar. Then you need two eggs, room temperature, uh one teaspoon of vanilla extract, pinch of sea salt, and uh one half a cup, uh, one cup plus uh, two tablespoons of heavy cream. All right. all right now. So, all right, so for the instructions, it says place the chocolate chips. So, so it says place the chocolate chips, sugar, egg, vanilla extract, salt, and heavy cream into the blender in this order and the order listed. So, mm -hmm. first you want to put these in. Yep. Put those in. Do a put. What you got next? All right, so next we have the sugar. So put that in there. Then we got the eggs. Careful with the eggs now. Don't let them spill. All right, put that in there. Then vanilla extract. And then, and then you put the salt. And then you put the heavy cream in. Alright, All right, then you pop on the lid. Alright. Turn the lid around. There you go. Put it down. And now turn it and lock it. Perfect. Hit the power button on. Now, what button does it tell you to push? And then select sauce dip. All right. Looks like it's going to take 30 minutes and then a couple of hours for everything to chill. So, this recipe and machine is literally so easy that a kid could do it. Yeah. Please pardon the mess in the back because, you know, no, they haven't done the dishes yet. <laughs> All right. We'll be back when it's done. Bye bye. Figured I'd turn it back on and let you see where we're at. There we are. How many minutes we got? 21 minutes left. Well, so now uh, pots of the cream is now done. So uh, I'm going to have some help from uh, my grandpa to help me pour it in. All right, so we got to pour it into some cups and it's going to take about three or four hours to chill. I never even heard of something called pots de cream before. Yeah, never mind, but it sounded good, so. <laughs> but this is what he wanted to make. Oh, looks like chocolate pudding is what it looks like. It, it, well, I mean, it didn't say sauce or dip, so. Smells great. Mm. Well, I mean, it's probably just like, it's probably just like a sauce. Oh, it said four. Yeah. Well, we only made three. Probably had a little too much in this cup. That's okay. all right. Don't worry about it. Three works. Three works. Though. Three work. I mean, after all, not lots of us gonna have this besides me. So. <laughs> all right. So this is what it looks like. So. Let's bring so it in. That was the last cup, so it's small. So we're gonna chill it, and I will tell you what it looks like in about four hours. It's made back. So, uh, seems like, so we got the pot of cream done. Hold on. It's right there. Honestly, I had a lot of fun making it. And, uh, it's epic. Now, uh, we're gonna go have a t taste test. All right, Dairy Queen test. Let's, the first things first, it does not move. At all? Uh, if you tip it upside down, which is pretty cool. Yeah. Okay, all right. now we eat. Taste test. Ooh, that's got a thick layer on Okay. Tastes like chocolate pudding. Yeah, no, I I agree with that. It does. It's like a little fancier version of it. It's like chocolate pudding mixed with chocolate frosting. Would you make yeah. it again? It, yes, definitely we would make this again. Yes. Was it easy? Mm-hmm. All right. Took a long, long time, like like 
Four hours. Four hours? Four hours to set. Four hours to set. And you can put whipped cream on it, and it's not quite as cold as ice cream, but it's definitely just as chocolate. Bring that over here, let them see how thick it is. Look at that. And then Frank? Show the spoon. Okay, spoon. This is a spoon. Alright. Alright, say goodbye. Bye. Sure.